hi leo welcome back to my channel okay this is your next 48 this is episode 21 and 22 for my leos happy birthday okay the first day of leo the 22nd all right sun moon rising in the north node my lion all right let's see what's going on with my lion all right sun moon rising in the north node please and thank you okay let's see card came out let's see what it is okay we have the world card okay so something is over or something is beginning a new cycle all right i'm getting something is fixed i'm also getting two leo you are a, an amazing dancer or you're very enticing all right let's see i'm, I'm getting that you're coming in and changing changing a situation a situation that was fixed or um, there's something that's already set in place and you kind of come in and you kind of manipulate the situation or you're, you're being very persuasive. It's like you're breaking the rules or you're changing something up. All right, let's see. It's almost like someone is like, no, this is, um, I'm on a fixed income or these are fixed rules or these are the regulations or this is the way things are done around here. You're like, oh, really? You just, you just start like talking and moving and everything just changes. I'm getting everyone is watching you, all eyes on you. Are you a dancer? All right, let's see. We have the nine of cups. Yeah, I'm getting, you are very dreamy. I'm getting a lot of people want you. Yeah, nine of cups energy. All right. But the nine of cups in this deck, there's two people here. So I'm getting there's somebody else here with you, indulging with you. Okay, this could be a, this could be a birthday or something. All right, I'm getting someone's at a someone's at a strip club. All right, let's see. Yeah, drunk in love. Yeah, we have the princess of uh, pentacles. Okay, or the page of pentacles. All right, so I'm getting whatever you do for work. It's like you work very well with your hands. People love to watch you. I'm getting you are very mesmerizing, very irresistible. All right. Okay, let's see. Yeah, we have the Seven of Cups. Yeah, you're causing a lot of confusion here. Yeah, we have the Six of Cups. Wow. And then we have the Eight of Pentacles. We have the Eight of Wands and we have the... Wow. Okay, so something is happening. I'm getting serendipity or a lot of messages, a lot of communication is happening here. I'm getting two uploads. Maybe you make dance videos and you're uploading them. I'm also getting two... I don't know why this is coming up, but Wi-Fi... Your Wi-Fi is super fast. I'm getting like a lot of videos are uploading all at one time. Like all of a sudden, you're like on the scene. You're like, boom, pow. Okay. Because the Eight of Pentacles is what you do for work. I'm getting, your, I'm getting your, your, your job or your work is blossoming. You are blossoming at work. I'm getting like all of a sudden something is just like, just boom. All right, something comes out something comes out of nowhere there's some type of shift that comes out of nowhere there's all this communication all these people are after you or all these people want you i'm getting to like dance a lot of dancing i'm getting to like you're you're an exceptional dancer like i i have to keep saying that whatever you do i'm getting you are exceptional at it right, let's go around again. what's the seven of cups though now, for those of you who are not who are not uh, dancers, I'm getting something else. Something is over. I'm getting I'm getting you're letting something go because it's not what you want anymore, or you're just not getting what you want. This could be a job or the way that you were conducting business. It has to change. Okay, what's the seven of cups? Now you may not know how to do this. But I'm, I'm also getting too, you can't change the past, so stop trying. Just keep moving forward. Okay, what's the Seven of Cups, please? What is the Seven of Cups? Seven of Cups. Yeah, we have the Two of Wands. You're trying to figure out how to do this, how to freak this, how to change this. Which path is best for you? I'm also getting to you're going back to doing some, something that you used to do in your past, maybe paint, sing, dance. It could be YouTube. The world card is, is the world wide web to me. Okay, what's the world card, first of all? I want to see what came before what, what came before the world card, like what ended. 
because something is complete here. You've completed something. Yeah, we have the judgment card in the reverse. Yeah, no second chances. No more second chances. No, no going back to the past. Because I'm, I'm getting you had multiple chances to make a first impression and you failed or somebody failed with you. All right. Because the judgment, the judgment card is, you know, looking at yourself, looking at your mistakes, you know, judging yourself. It's also getting a second chance to make a first impression or this is your calling, but I'm, I'm getting with the judgment card coming up inverted. It's almost like somebody or you, you're failing to see your mistakes or you're failing to see how something is repeated or you're failing to see the patterns in life or the patterns in a situation. Because I'm, I'm getting the past is here, the six of cups. So this could be, of course, reminiscing, thinking about the past, being taken care of, uh, um, sweet gestures. All right. Somebody looking after you, taking care of you. But I'm, but I'm getting like that's over. Because I'm, the world card is here. It's like after we have the nine of cups. Let's go around again for you. Let's go around again. All right, let's see. Let's bring the story together a little bit. Because I'm kind of getting like, I, I, I was getting that. I was, I was getting like greed, like selfishness. Because we have the devil card. Yeah, we have the king of pentacles and we have the devil card. Yeah, I'm getting somebody is very greedy with their money. They're very selfish. Could be a Capricorn. Definitely, we have a Capricorn showing up here twice. Okay, because it's almost it's almost like you were. It, this is what you wanted. You wanted someone to maybe take care of you, look after you, you know, just be kind to you. I'm getting you want someone who's gentle and sweet, someone who treats you very well. Six of Cups. This is like being looked after. Someone kissing you on your cheek, making sure you're that, that you're okay. You want someone to care for you, but I'm getting someone just just does not care anymore. I'm also getting too, you don't, you don't really care for money or you don't care for this kind of work anymore. You want to stop. You don't want to do this type of work anymore, whatever this is. But I'm getting like somebody is greedy. Somebody is money hungry. I'm getting like somebody is obsessed with money or somebody only cares about what they want. What is the princess of pentacles? Yeah, the five of wands. Yeah. So I'm getting this is a situation about your work. Now, this could be a tendency of yours. You you're very selfish and you're very ego driven. Um, Leo, I feel like with the six of wands, yeah, that's the ego, that's success, that's arrogance, that's me first. That's I'm in, I'm in, I'm in the lead. I'm, I'm in the parade. I'm successful. Likes, comments, subscribe. So somebody may be coming off as very arrogant or on their high horse. Okay. But I'm, I'm getting like, it's almost like. I'm getting the chances were given though. There were second chances given or you tried to get back together with someone or you tried to work with someone a second time, but someone is very selfish. All they care about is themselves. All they care about is what they want and what they can get out of the situation, what they can get out of you. I'm getting like somebody, this is, this is their devil. Someone is very selfish, just period. I'm getting to someone is money hungry. All they care about is money or status or success. I'm getting somebody's heart is not really in the whole endeavor. It's all about the money. It's all about what they can get out of people. I'm getting somebody uses people. You don't fuck with that. You don't fuck with that energy. Yeah, I'm getting to somebody's very competitive. Now, this is you. This is the five of wands. That's the first deacon of Leo. We are entering Leo. So this is the first deacon of your sign. The first 10 days of Leo is going to be the five of wands. So I'm getting it could be very competitive. Somebody's competing with you or competing for your spot, competing for your job. It could be a Capricorn, of course. I'm getting like somebody wants to take your position, but I'm getting there's no chance. Okay, because if you do something just for money, it's not going to go anywhere. Okay, what's the Six of Cups? Now, this could have been in the past. Somebody was like this towards you. You tried to give somebody a chance to work with you or you tried to give somebody a chance to prove themselves, but they just turned out to be very selfish, very toxic, very stingy. Somebody does not know how to work together in a team. I'm getting two. Somebody does not know how to build because the Princess of Pentacles is like, now, this could be a person, though. I'm getting some, like, it's like too competitive, it's like somebody somebody is copying you or somebody wants to do it how you do it. What is the six of cups? Yeah, we have the nine of swords. Yeah, somebody, you have somebody, somebody is shook. Somebody is worried about this. Somebody's worried about money. Somebody's worried about you or your job. Or this could be you. What's the eight of pentacles, please? Yeah, we have the princess of cups, page of cups. Okay. I'm getting like somebody is a young, somebody is a prodigy. Somebody's very successful. 
Now, this could be you, Leo. I'm only getting one Leo card. So this, this could be people that you're dealing with, competition, people around you who are talking shit, talking shit behind your back, or people trying to bring you down or compete with you. Now, I'm getting in the past you were worried about this or you were worried about what somebody's motives were about with you or you're worried about what somebody's motives are now. I'm also think I'm also getting as well in the past you thought somebody was only you thought you thought maybe somebody was having sex for money or somebody was doing something um oh my god degrading for money it's almost it's almost like somebody thinks that you're doing something degrading or devilish or to get where you are it's almost cuz I'm, I'm getting I'm hearing people talking shit about you like oh well she had sex with him to get that or she did magic to get that or you know she 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 she, she sold her soul to get that or some shit I'm getting like people are just running their fucking mouths. They don't know what the hell they're talking about. I'm getting you worked hard for this. Okay, because the eight of pentacles, I mean, that could be, now people can, maybe you are a mason. That could be the top, I'm getting you are the topic of discussion here. Like, yeah, she's a mason. She's in the Illuminati or he's in the Illuminati. He's a mason or, you know, he didn't, he didn't get that by, um, you know, by honest means, but I'm getting, you did. The eight of pentacles is working hard. It's working hard. It's being focused. It's concentrating. It's, it's, uh, it's working hard diligently. It's doing something every single day. It's keeping your nose to the grindstone. And that's why you're blossoming. Not because you signed your, not, not because you signed your life away or because you're having sex with the devil or whatever the hell people are saying, don't worry about it. Because I'm getting a lot of people are saying a lot of shit about you or how you're about your work, but whatever. People are jealous, I feel like, because you're successful. I'm getting it's like people are talking about how you became successful or how you're doing this. How, how does she do that or how did he do this? How did he get to where he is? Because I'm getting, I'm getting, you're gaining a following and you're gaining a following quick likes, comments, subscribes. You get a lot of engagement or you're very popular. I'm getting you're very popular and you're very liked, maybe even loved. People love you just because you're a Leo. I mean, you you rule popularity. But I'm getting like somebody could be jealous of you or worried about this. Okay, what's the five of wands? But I'm, I'm really, I'm getting to like somebody sees you, like someone's competing with you. Are you competing with someone? All right. Okay, what's the five of wands? Where's the five of wands, please? I'm getting people do not congratulate you, Leo. They don't give you the recognition that you deserve. They just talk shit behind your back. And I mean, that's, it, that comes with the territory. It comes with being popular. It comes with making money. It comes with being successful. People talk shit. Okay, what's the five of wands? Oh, well. Yeah, we have the magician, exactly. Well, this is a good thing, though. People, you, you are the topic of discussion. People are talking about you. That's a great thing. People feel like, oh, you're you're in the Illuminati. <laughs> you're a Freemason. You sold your soul to the devil. She, you you're working with the devil. You you have to be a Freemason. You have to be Illuminati. You you have to because how did you get so successful? How do you have all this money? How are you how are you doing these things? How are you getting what you want? People don't see the work that goes in, do they? All right. Trust me, I feel you. What's the six? What is the six of cups, nine of swords? But I'm getting really what it is. People are worried about you. They're scared of you. You are you're you're. Comp I'm getting I'm getting with the because the high priestess came out. I'm getting Leo. You don't have to work as hard as everybody else, but you get twice as much. And people are you got people shook, boy. People shook. I'm getting I'm getting like you just came in and kind of wrecked shit. You just came in and kind of took over, and people are worried. People are scared that you're taking over. I'm getting you're taking your place in the world. This is your calling. But people don't want you to people don't want you to do people don't want you to be doing this. I'm getting two people could be trying to ruin your name or ruin your reputation, talking shit behind your back, spreading rumors, but that's okay. People are shook. They're shook. Somebody is shaking in their boots, man. What is the uh what is the six of swords and the nine of swords? Six of swords, nine of swords. Now this could be this could be somebody else it could be a capricorn talking shit behind your back it could be multiple people they're like oh man they're he's a magician she's a magician she sold her soul what's the six of cups or the nine of swords people people funny <laughs> yeah the five of cups yeah because i'm getting like okay there you are leo yeah i'm getting you're super resilient you're super strong 
you hold your own. You just keep moving forward. You don't, you don't stop to talk shit. You don't stop to get involved in drama. You do not stop. And that's why you're successful. You don't, you don't, you don't stop to worry about nobody else. You just keep moving forward. And that's why you're successful because you do it every day. You're diligent, you're focused, you're concentrated. This is what you do. This is your calling and you're doing it. People are jealous. I'm not saying that in here, but obviously they are. I'm getting two people cannot stop talking about you. And that is a great thing, especially for popularity. There's no such thing as bad press. So you could be getting a lot of, you know, negative feedback or bad reviews or people talking shit about you or just saying negative things about you, but that's okay. They're really sad. Because you're moving up or you're moving on. I'm getting people are worried too. People are worried that you're moving very quickly. But it's like, yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm not saying anything negative about this reading besides other people talking shit about you. I'm getting to somebody could be doing work on you. Somebody could be doing witchcraft on you. To keep you stuck or to ruin your chances. But I'm getting they can't ruin your chances. Even with, even, with, even with the judgment card in the reverse, this is still your calling. You may be confused about this sometime. Like, damn, am I supposed to be doing this? Did I sell my soul to the devil? Am I doing the right thing? Yes. Other people will try to make you feel like you're not doing the right thing or this is not for you. They're fucking wrong. They're jealous. They're your competition. They don't want you to be doing this because you're great at it. I'm getting somebody's trying to confuse you and make you think that this is not what you're supposed to be doing. You're not supposed to be popular. You're not supposed to be doing it this way, but you are. Leo, you are a natural wizard. You are a magician by birth. Okay, Leo, you rule the will. It requires will to do witchcraft. It requires will to do magic. And I'm getting to somebody's magic is not working and they're worried about it. What is the, what is the uh, five of wands and the magician together for? Five of wands and the magician. Yeah, the five of swords. Somebody's, somebody's doing work on you. I'm getting somebody's trying, to, somebody's trying to create competition where there is none or somebody sees you as an adversary. Somebody's trying to worry you or someone's trying, it's like somebody's trying to make, somebody's trying to keep you sad or keep you worried or make you confused. Someone is causing confusion in your life. Someone's doing work on you to cause you confusion, to, to, to trip your money up. Somebody does not want you to get what you want, but you are going to get what you want because you actually work hard. You put the work in. Energy is spent here. So I'm getting, there's, no, there's nothing anybody can do to stop this from happening for you because you actually work with your hands. You actually expend your energy out into the universe so it comes back to you. It doesn't matter what magic they do. You rule the will, so it doesn't matter. They, it's not going to work because this is your calling. The universe, is, the universe puts you here. Can't nobody take you, can't nobody, uh, take you out of this. Th there's no one that can stop you. No man, no human, no force, no nothing. Yeah, we have, the, we have the King of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles. I'm getting somebody feels entitled to your money or somebody feels, somebody is, wants your money. That's what I'm getting. Somebody's money hungry. But I'm getting, I'm getting, you're just fine. You have nothing to worry about. I'm getting like somebody is missing out and there, somebody is butthurt. Somebody's sad about that because you chose this, you chose this path. You chose this as your destiny, and I'm getting you're doing that shit, and you're doing it well. Okay, what's the uh, eight of eight of uh, pentacles and the princess of cups? But I'm getting somebody is projecting their fears onto you. Don't listen. All right, what is the eight of pentacles and the uh, princess of cups? Yeah, the four of swords. You're you're on easy street. You're fine. I'm getting you have peace of mind. Nothing can worry you. We have the lovers card. Yeah, I'm getting people love you. People patronize your business. You get hell of engagement. I'm getting you're doing what you love. And that's why you can't be stopped because you do it because you love it, not because of the money. And that's why, you're, that's why the money is coming in because, because that's not why you do this. All right, let's see. All right, good shit, Leo. All right, love cards for Leo, please. Love cards for my Leo. I'm not seeing a lot of love here, but... Let's pull some for shits and giggles, all right? Yeah, we have express your love. Really, somebody's in love with you. Somebody wants to be with you. Somebody wants to be on that horse with you, but they can't, all right? But I'm also, I'm getting to this as people. 
This could be your, this could be customers, clients. All right. But I'm getting to this is over. Like if somebody has been playing mind games, if somebody has been doing work on you, if, if someone has been com competing with you or trying to create something that's not there, worry, confusion, that's over. I'm getting what somebody really wants to do is express their love to you. Somebody wants to say, hey, I love you. Somebody, somebody, because you know, there's a very thin line between admiration and envy. I'm getting somebody really loves your ass, but they also hate you because they, they're not, they can't do it like you do it. Yeah, we have retreat. Yeah. I'm also getting to somebody express their love to you and you ignore them or you, you want hermit mode. I'm getting all you care about is your life's work and what you love. You love, you love your work. You have peace of mind when you're there. And I'm getting somebody is mad or somebody, somebody's very envious because you went ghost. Because you have better shit to do than to compete and to argue and shit. Yeah, we have wedding. Yeah, so I'm getting a very, a very serious relationship ended or a wedding ended and you focus, you're focusing on your dreams now. And of course, somebody's mad. They're obsessed. All right, so I'm going to leave it there. Don't forget to like the video, leave your comments, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.